Every week, we scour the internet to find the most amazing, creative, and jaw-dropping content developed in Unity. This is Game Dev HQ, and enjoy the best of made with Unity. Leading off, Marpy calls her Mishka a digital performer. I call it Cthulhu Dance Party Time! What Nintendo don't, Bat Galactic does. Awesome work on this third person space shooter. Mark made this really neat hand drawn subterranean adventure game. Gun and Gun added some difficulty to this sniper game with a conveyor belt and shields. Point Blank shows off a really neat tower defense game with hundreds of spawned enemies. Alex Cortez took some feedback and improved upon his explosion simulations. Polly Toot shows you how you can build this water simulation system into your game. Go check it out. Age of Rust keeps looking better and better with each and every update. Rare Breed shows off some more action-packed blazing strike footage. Color Fiction reveals The Sands of Voltar 2.0, which is now on itch.io. Baruch created a very interesting voxel city being built in real time using the visual effects graph. Little Mountain just showed everyone how you can build amazing effects in VR for Unity. Armored Games Studio shares Zombotron, a 2D space adventure, now available on Steam. Polygon Treehouse shared with me why they are great at facial animations, and I am not. Finally, Lead Follow Games thanks everyone for promoting their game, Tiny Tanks. After years of development, it's finally on Steam. Thank you to everyone who watches and shares these videos. Let's keep working together to promote hardworking indie devs like Armor Game Studios by sharing these videos so their dreams continue to take flight. This was the best of Made with Unity. Be sure to hashtag Made with Unity and we will do our best to share your creation with the entire game dev world. We are Game Dev HQ and we are out of here. See you next week.